involved, got into it. And especially the family that's come together. But you know, you can't have a family if you know all of it. Any man that live a baby, I mean, say you the doctor, you the catch the baby. I mean, you the deliver the baby. Any man that do that, young? Oh. So, I can't have a family and people like without the own. So, that's why all the time people are kind of young, or cracky teeth with me, or stand who we be, and take like a daddy. But now I stand. But we done did one these your porch and the piazza and take like a daddy. And I know the day you want to inside that family compound. I read it was how you supposed to get to the family union. And usually, big daddy, mama, daddy. And usually, the, the mama, the family, the matriarch. What I tell her, say, her have to come on you. Know your family. Know who you done. But you can't know who you done if you never run them. You can't know who you done if you never crack your teeth with them and think like a daddy. But you see one thing? Sometimes when there are the people that are in the house, we don't go by and see how them. We stay right there and even be the church and say, what never happened to the so and so used to sit on that road right here? But they never go by the house. And no one did right there at the house, they can't make it look at it. Yes, ma'am, I ain't a story. Oh, kidding. You, you stay right there, you go by the deacon. And even ask the deacon, say, um, I ain't even seen the so and so in a while. Y'all know where it is? Then the deacon can tell all I say, yeah, they did right home and think like I never can drive no more. No, the deacon said, I don't know. Say so. Okay. The deacon said, I don't know. How the deacon did not know? It's time for them. They want their money more. I tell you now, the deacon act like they want the ward at the jailhouse than the ward. Yeah. But watch over the soul and thing. What they write wrong. We have to pass on them. They think to the pastor, they do everything. But the pastor doesn't want to break the word. But how do I have to live that word? You understand? So I don't need to say, I want this your title and I want that title there. And then look up. My people the one most for the foundation for this your talk. You might have brought them up and throw that one back somewhere else if you ain't gonna hold the foundation in the building up. So don't want just be wrong and see people missing in the community and you ain't know where you've been. You ain't know where you at. Sometimes they right in the house. But you ain't going by and not money do. They can't come out like you used to. So sometimes we just have to check on the elders and see how we're doing. Sometimes we must have to go there. If you just bring them on the phone, y'all be surprised how glad he is just for hearing your voice. You can just crack your teeth a couple of water with them and then ah, get out of the way. Know how you're messing with you so good that you look out for me. The red is striking the law. You know, I tell you just so. And the man what he said now, just like they want to tell you, hold on to God, I'm changing it. It tell you things like that. Better off the soul. It also tell you you better mind. Don't smell yourself now. Yeah, it's easy for me. I just did it for the monkey. I can't say so you got turn and grab turn and you got never keep growing in the eyes. Respect your elders. But you ain't but two days older than me. I older than you know. That way it tell you anything. And you can't say, well, you ain't my mama. Your child may have a fast mouth. But you know one thing? We used to learn all that thing. Just sitting around. Sitting sometime in the yard. Sometimes sitting on the porch. Sometimes they live on the piazza. Sometimes with good breeze when I'm going all the time. And one of the breeze been wipe a paper or a bag you could have picked up and do this young and take like that in your own self. But we may have been old. And now look at we now. You know, we've gone to school. We have houses that the bank owns, that the bank owns. <laughs> or a local name on a deed now, that the bank owns. And then we sit with one another and 
in the air conditioning. And we have the telephone, and when it rings, we don't pick it up. We look at it. Okay, no, no, I don't feel like talking with her today. You ain't want to talk to her, but you want $20 since 1959, you're afraid to go ask for it. The woman ain't going to study that. But we do all of that. And the more that we close ourselves inside, in those cold places, we become just as cold as they are. The more that we put those walls around us, the more we act like we can never exit out of them. So don't let nobody build no box for you. Because God will get you people they never live well in no box. The family circle that they've always been a sucker. Anyway, the family come home. And you know, if it's two or the dead end, one one come home, I'll be going down one day. One with Terry and one with Akali. I never so well, cause they know his name in an E. And I say, yeah, yeah, body wrong your body is her tongue. And you know Terry and Carly there would have gathered some time in the evening, put up y'all to them. And I asked their turn, we all call them father, but we call that thing a porch. They said, oh, because we're from Charleston. So we don't have porches. We got piazzas. Because see, I was doing just sit in the front of the house and wrap all around the side. Look at look, 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 look the Madonna hat going on around here. That's why you need a lighthouse to find it way around the own house. Because they stretch all around. So that way when the sun shift you, know, you could have just gone around. And when the breeze shift you, know, you could have just gone on to the other side. And then somebody could have come out there with a tea, you know. And sometimes they would have said for something in chair like Regina. This young gal, Regina, they come up from Santana one time. And they called them up there. And they sat up but bring something to the elders. What when I sit there in the yard so and they say, this young gal grown young, take it grown, you know. But we got a lot of saying growing yeah. But you know, there are all the people that tell you they got lucky, but then when you try to sit around the grown people and yell and say, What do you do? Run you back or saw. Tell you what, but do what? <laughs> now you're going to stay out of here for one play and going to stay out what? Grown up for conversation. Grown up for business. So now, we got a lot to chill on sometimes about the culture and about who we be. So one day I said, tell her, they're going to get that gal in China. Oh, I tell me that gal to get you down. See, if it gets you back, I tell her when the company and the Terry them been going to be. And I said, well, Gina, get out, I'm going to have a come with me. And we have to love her, but that going to get you on. But look, y'all know, you ain't about to follow get you gal. So I'm going to have a grow up, be a woman. And you know what thing you ain't gonna let no man to that woman oh, man. Uh -uh. That feel I sing that song. And you call an African woman woman. She gonna sit. I believe. Alright, now there you go, call me. I believe you. Okay. So I know who you look for woman. You know how. But you know, do you not care? What in the one? Yeah, I want to do. We gotta do well. Y'all don't sound like y'all do it well. I said, how want to do? We do well. Oh, I can't hear y'all. Y'all must be unhealthy or something like that. How want to do? Ah. All right, all right. That's what I like to hear. Yeah, uh, Before I begin, I just want to say a little bit. Uh, I'm very thankful for Queen Quet inviting me to perform for y'all today. It's a great honor. Um, I'm going to share with y'all a poem that I wrote, especially for this occasion. And uh, I'm pretty sure if you have a lick of gonna get you in your tongue like this, you're gonna understand what I'm saying. You got me? You got me? Thank you, thank you. All right. Now, as a young gonna get you woman, there's some things I may do. And you might not understand unless, of course, you were get you too. Now, life in my shoes hasn't always been easy. So everything I've done, there's been a deeper reason. 
in the 18 years for God gave me. And I've been many places from sea to shining sea. And every place I enter, I must say, how what I do? And the people look at me. Where are you from? And who are you? And I've got no choice but to reply with the truth. I say it's St. Helena Island, South Carolina. It's where I spent my youth. And some say, no, you can't be from there. You, you speak so well. And you have beautiful hair. And at this point, I'm forced to ask, well, just what do you mean by that? My people, we speak fine, as a matter of fact. You, my friend, should use some tact. Does my dialect offend you? Do you scorn my rhyme? We are always being misjudged. It's a time, it's a time. Now, I've never been arrogant or pompous or flashy, but if you doubt my response, then why'd you even ask me? I repeat this question and answer scheme time and time again. I become so agitated, aggravated, astonished at these people who try to interrogate me. Why are you offended by the way that I speak? Or better yet, the way we crack your teeth. I grow so tired of this explanation, trial, and tribulation. See, my people, we revolve around our culture's liberation. So, so heavily the Gullah Geechee spirit flows because it knows the chokeholds of today's society. Many of us forced to move about silently, constantly accused of acting violently. So excuse me if I get a little salty when you people start trying me. Now don't get me wrong, that wasn't the end. We Gullah Geechee people have a neck that most can't comprehend. See, when we traveled these waters a long time ago, our bodies made a beat that'll have you tapping your toes. We'll just be slapping and clapping and singing and shouting, saying, oh Lord, I won't turn back and make my need shame. At the top of our lungs, you would think it's all fun and games, but no. The words I sing and the beats I make, they tune my faith that God keeps me and my people safe. So over time, I, I get older and I grow louder and prouder, embracing my culture without a doubt. So today, if you happen to be passing and you ask me, I would have to say, I'm just well engaged. So in future days, my sons and daughters can say, yes, I am a descendant of Gola and Giche. So now I've learned and I've grown. So today, if you were happy, if you were passing and you happen to ask me who we be, I'd have to say, we're just double Geechee. Thank you.
You ain't forget nothing. All right. Oh. And then what else? You used to have to have on the apron in it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I had put mine on first, though. Okay. <laughs> oh, I remember that one, then. Yeah. yeah. The apron. And okay. then sometimes when they come from church, after they done take off the girdle and they brisee. Yeah. Yeah. Because you look right at what a girl and a brisee. You know that's right, because they have to keep you money. That's right. Yeah. Right down. And the tucky money. Yeah. Money right what? Hmm. Then you had to put on the house dress and they had to get cool. Right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, hurry up now. We ain't got but so much time yet. Yeah. <laughs> I old. Oh, oh, no, I old. I wanted them, you know, Sookie, Sookie, one of them young old women. Well, one thing, let's take it back to Sunday. And Queen Quay actually talked about this on me. You used to talk about the sick and the shed in, eh? Now, my granddaddy been on the sick and the shed in last for about 15 years in a month. And the one thing Red used to make sure Red and in the last house he visited. Okay. Why even that? Because he all kind of eat. Oh, yeah. And my granny, because you know the more people used to cook now. Yeah. You used to cook on Sunday. Like on Sunday night, because you couldn't cook on Sunday because you be in church all day on Sunday. All right? And our church used to be so chapel, United Methodist Church, and they used to share preacher. So a church only used to meet every third Sunday. Every three Sunday, used to go to church. But when you go to church, you're going to be there from sun up to sundown, four day in the morning and after dusk. That's right. Because what happened is the singing choir, the combined choir, the church choir, and every other choir had the same. Church was so long that people used to sell soda and nab in the back of the That's church. Right. That's right. That's right. Well, we used to make a meal out of the mint candy, you know. Yes, sir. And you can't open that mint candy car for the lady in the church at the time. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. And do like this. That's right. That's right. Get beat. But after that, the, the, the prayer was short, but the stay belong for Red when he come to see Granddad. Because Grandmama done cooked some chicken, some rice, about 16 different vegetables, and you have to have something sweet now. You have to have a dessert. You need some sweet bread, some ice cream, or something like that. That's right. But one thing about Granny, Granny had kept the family together. Yeah. And yes. Granny always had a grandchild in it. Yeah, he had a grandchild. Uh oh. That's right. Oh, and had that grandchild. That's right. That's right. Always. <laughs> Don't call me and say on me now. My granny used to always to sing a hymn to put them chair in the sleep, right? Used to put them right here and pat them to sleep. So probably when everybody had that back problem, you remember I used to pat your heart. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you used to sing them old songs. The right. old songs. So oh. like, remember, oh, the blood. Oh, yeah. Oh, the blood. 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 Sign my name. Then that next verse said, 